What's going on everyone? Charlie here, bringing you another quick video regarding the systematic internalizers. Another quick look. So you know how the data we just looked at for AMC and GameStop was measured between October 1st, 2020 and March 31st of this year? Well, guess how many, just take a wild guess at how many shares of AMC and GameStop were traded using this method before that reporting period. That's right, zero. So before October 1st of 2020, there was zero shares traded using this systematic internalizer as no data was reported during this reporting period. And this was actually from April 1st to, yes, October 1st. Okay, perfect. Same thing for GameStop, zero. So I think that's clear evidence that this is primarily a uh, an instrument that's being used to manipulate because as of October of last year, now all of a sudden we have 4 billion GameStop and the 1 billion AMC. Hmm. I don't know. Pretty interesting that before then not one share was found on here. So just wanted to point that out. Oh, and also check this out. The, the EU finds firms fall short on MIFID2 uh, suitability rules. MIFID2 is what regulates the systematic internalizers. Am I being watched? I don't know. I can't read this article because I don't have a subscription, but just thought that was interesting timing. <laughs> so anyways, Jack to the TTs. Talk to y'all later.